If you haven't heard of Zucchero, Italy's incredible pop, rock and blues superstar, you must have been curled up under a rock for ages. He's hailed as the father of the Italian blues. He's one of the few European singer-songwriters who's enjoyed and still enjoys massive international success. Zucchero sold over 60 million albums. He's won numerous awards and has collaborated and performed with the likes of Eric Clapton, Mark Knopfler, Miles Davis, Ray Charles, B.B. King, Sting, Bono, Luciana Pavarotti and Andrea Bocelli. Good news for Australia... Zucchero is about to bring his acclaimed Black Cat World Tour here, the tour that has seen him perform all over Europe, the US and Canada to standing ovations. I'm thrilled to have Zucchero on the line now. Welcome. Lovely to chat with you. Hi. <laughs> nice to meet you. Zucchero is actually a name that means sugar in Italian, isn't it? How did you get the name and why did it stick uh -huh. so? Ah, that uh, that is coming from when I was at the ele ele elementary school, and uh, there was a, a teacher, a very nice lady, and and uh, and, uh, and I was very, you know, very very shy and, and uh, very edu well educated, and uh, comparing to the other uh, other friends, and 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 I was always in the last uh, the last uh, uh, in the class in the in, in the desk you no know, in the last desk of the class yeah she thought I was sweet uh, she thought I was you know very cute and, and she started me to to call me Zuccherino then then you know you can imagine the others uh, oh they was all laughing and, and they keep keep you know making jokes around this Zuccherino, 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 then, and then I became Zucchero for everybody. That was my name, my nickname, but it, it takes the place of my real name. <laughs> it's very gorgeous. Many people would want to have such a sweet name. It's sweet, but <laughs> it doesn't mean that my, my voice is not sweet at all. It's very rough. It's I don't a, know if, a, he, if he fit. <laughs> it's a good, rough voice, but comes from a very sweet person. Thank you. Um, Zuccaro, you're best known in Australia for the hit single Senza Una Donna with Paul Young that was released um, quite a while ago now in 91. That um, was a yeah. top 40 chart hit here, but it went mm -hmm. top five right across the world, including the US and, and in the UK. Does that song remain your favourite song today? To be honest, when I released this song, I didn't want to put on the album. <laughs> That that uh, you know that that is me. I thought that uh, the song uh, you know was mm, too not too melancholic, but I mean I, I you know I I don't want to put on the album. Then uh, my my the producer of the album said, "But are you crazy? This song you know is is a great song. You 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 can't uh, don't put this song in the album." You have to put it in the album. So he convinced me to, to put the song in the album, and and it became a big hit in Italy one year before. The, uh, and Paul Paul uh, was in in Italy uh, for holidays with the family. Mm -hmm. and he heard this song on the radio. Then and and uh, one year after the song was already a hit in Italy. Uh, the, uh, one year after, fun you know a combination. Uh, uh, we, I was in the studio, and he was in the same studio recording his own new album. Huh. And we meet at the breakfast, uh, and he said, "Are you Zucker?" I said, "Yeah, I was. A f I'm still a fan of of, of uh, Paul Young." And he said, "Oh, you know, I heard this song in Italy last year." When I was on holiday, and I love this song, I would love to do this song, to cover this song in the album and do it in English. I said, "Wow, fantastic! Thank you. It's an honor." And but why we don't do it together? That's uh, that's why we start. Oh, yeah, he, he's a very nice guy. He's, uh, he's a great artist, and mm -hmm. we start to we we start to you know to recording this song without to without uh, tell anything to the record company oh, nice. and uh, and we did it and then we sent it to the record company and uh, the, the my record company the, they decided to put out this duet 
and without any video, without any promotion. It's just that they sent it to the radio, and the radio started to play. And it was amazing that, uh, you know, the song is, is be, it start to be successful without any promotion and any video. Yeah, well, it's, it's certainly a brilliant song. You've written so many great songs. Tell me, how do you write them? Do you lock yourself away in a small room, or is there a favorite place that you go to? Where do you go, and, and where do you take the inspiration from? Yeah, I have a, I have a small shake, shack in uh, mm -hmm. in uh, in Tuscany where is uh, there is the main house is a is a farm with you know all the animals and and, and olive oil, olive trees and all, uh, vineyard and all this stuff and then uh, you know at the end of the of the property I have this uh, shack that that I, I call the house of blues <laughs> where I. <laughs> Where I go when I have to write, and I have all my instruments, uh, uh, and and when I'm writing, I'm, I'm sleeping there. You know, they they they, and I don't want to stay with nobody. <laughs> I have to stay by myself. Uh -huh. They take me the food. They take me the you know what I need. Uh, but uh, I I I leave, I stay there for six months until I I'm I'm, I'm happy with the music. Oh, that's amazing. And when you walk around your town or anywhere in Italy, do the people just mob you? Mm, yeah, but they are very... I respect them and they are they respect me. Of course, uh, you know, I can't walk uh, during the day easily, I mean, uh, because everybody's asking for aut autograph or photos. Yeah. Now we we have this selfie and I, get, I go crazy with the selfie. Everybody asking selfie. <laughs> but in the small village where I live, they uh, they're habit to to see me uh, at the bar, you know, yeah. drinking coffee or stay around. But uh, and so and they and they try to protect me when when someone else is is coming to, to and and go to my 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 place to to try to see me. They and if someone a stranger is coming and say where is the Zucchero house, they say I don't know. <laughs> is that is that sort of fame the the price of fame? Is that difficult to deal with? Not for me because. I choose, you know, I choose to do this job, and 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 you know, and 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 it's part of this. Uh, it's part of the, the other side of the coin, but yeah. Uh, um, Zuckero, your music collaborations really read like a who's who in rock royalty. Um, I mentioned some at the start. The list spans Sting, Bono, Jeff Beck, Ray Charles, Eric Clapton, Joe Cocker. Elvis Costello, Miles Davis, Peter Gabriel, John Lee Hooker, B.B. King, Mark Knopfler, Pavarotti, even Iggy Pop. If, if you yeah. had to choose one of them, who would you say that you've enjoyed working with the most? Uh, you know, with Miles Davis was the first uh, experience and I was shocked that he he wants to play in one of my track. And, and uh, because he likes the track, uh, he listened the track. <clears throat> I don't know in radio somewhere. And he, uh, so that will be in my memories. Is is uh, you know, the I first. was nobody. I was at the beginning, and uh, the yeah. big, my the great, my Davis is you know, this is something that I will never forget. But uh, I have to tell you, <clears throat> uh, even with Eric Clapton. That uh, I, I uh, he, he came to see one of my shows I can remember in Sicily probably, and he asked me to supporting in uh, in Europe for the the big arena tour, we, including twelve nights at the Royal Albert Hall. That was another big thing, and I have, mm. to, uh, have, I have to thank him because uh, you know he gave me the he opened the, uh, he, he helped me to open the door outside of of Italy in Europe. And then uh, my 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 big friend Pavarotti that we did you know 12 years every 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 year we did this charity thing Pavarotti and friends uh, where he was taking care about the classic orchestra and I was inviting all the you know the rock and pop artists and that was something uh, incredible. 
so many highlights you've had. It, it is incredible. The, the current world tour has seen you on the road through Europe and the US and through Canada pretty constantly since last September. I want to know what the trick is in keeping up your energy levels. I love um, music. I love my band. We are we are a fantastic. Uh, you know, we we feel very good together. We is a, there is a good vibe. We are friends, uh, and uh, it's very well organized. And uh, and I like travel. So uh, and I like to go on stage. Uh, <clears throat> it's just you know. I don't do nothing special. Uh, it's just uh, sleeping and, uh, and and go and and, and singing. <laughs> <laughs> but but you must have to live healthily in order to stay up late at night. You must eat the right yeah, food and exercise. Yeah, and... <laughs> yeah, it's not so easy for me because I like to. After the show, I like to go out for dinner, have, have good wine, good food, friends, and it's, it's not easy, but um, but I enjoy it. So uh, I think this is is the main. Yeah, absolutely. Main. So just to finish off, what are we going to see and hear from you here in Australia? I'm so excited to see you in concert. What, tell everybody what they're going to get from the Great Sukaro right around Australia. It's going to be a more than two hour shows, uh, show and uh, with a fantastic band, you know, musicians that, that uh, some of them are with me from the beginning, some, uh, some others they are great musicians, Americans musicians, they used to play with uh, Prince, uh, Beyonce, Eric Clapton, and uh, it, it's going to be, you know, I start with, <coughs> with uh, uh, some track of, of the new album, plus all the previous uh, uh, songs, uh, all is, is a tri- is a trip of my career, and so you, you, you will have uh, this uh, sense of Madonna, there will be a, du- a virtual du- duet on sc- in a big screen with uh, Pavarotti on Miserere, and uh, this is what it is is, a, is is the concert basically. I changed the running, the set list almost every night because <clears throat> with this band I can't afford to change two hours before the show all the songs that I want to change. <laughs> and and it's not you know every 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 concert is 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 a is a trip basically. Yeah, very good. Oh, we're excited. We look forward to seeing you all over this country. And uh, Zuccaro, thanks for the music and thanks for your time today. Uh, you're welcome. Very nice.